Hi, folks. This is the first Nagoya. Come on. The first Nagoya. We're testing the UHF band 420 to 448. Um, as you can see, it's not, not too swift at UHF. And it has the bass that looks like like that one. I believe that's the first one. Well, huh. It's this one, anyway. And here it is in the two meter portion of the band. A little better. Still not very, very impressed with it. Now this is a an antenna from uh, Yesu. Came with a VX5. Not bad. Two meter band, of course. I'm pretty sure that's what this came from. I can check it on UHF to see, but yeah, you see what it should do. Oh, and this is what that antenna looks like. Tell you the truth, I'm not sure what it comes from, except that it's almost for sure a VHF. Now here we are checking the original, the same band, 144, 148, two meter band, with a Baofeng antenna that comes on the Baofengs, made by Baofeng. Uh, says Baofeng right on it. Adapter, just like uh, Nagoya had. This is what they should look like. But in addition to uh, two meters, this one is capable of UHF, so let's check that out real quick. Okay, and just a representative portion of the UHF band. You can see it's not bad. Um, 437 to 448. Uh, not the entire two, uh, UHF band, but you can see what the uh, uh, SWR is like with the original Baofeng antenna. Same adapter, Baofeng antenna. Okay, this is the old uh, Nagoya antenna, and you can, as you can see, it still has a little bit of a problem at UHF. I believe the other Nagoya also had, the newer Nagoya had a problem on UHF. I was really surprised. Both of my Nagoya antennas are not very good on UHF. I'm going to switch this to VHF. And the old Nagoya on VHF. Quite a bit better than it was, but still three to one. She was not impressive at all. And I believe this is why Baofengs and maybe other radios are having a problem. Blowing finals. These Nagoya antennas are not good. And back to the uh, newer Nagoya, direct from Baofeng.com. So it is the real Nagoya. Three to one at VHF. That is this. See, hold it. Where did the camera go? Okay, here it is. This one. And it has the uh, little identifier on it. And these Nagoyas are changing a lot. Um, a very recent Nagoya had very good SWR on UHF, the same antenna. Had very good and UH, uh, UHF SWR and poor SWR on VHF. So these antennas are changing so much, 
It's just incredible. Thanks, folks. Sorry about the uh, background, but just wanted to get that audio in.